Right, I spoke about the dressing room. Not what I expect out of professionals all the time. I pay my instructions, watch your ass. Any questions? Let's go to work. We'll keep an eye on this one early. Chamberlain's got six wins in the first round. He stopped five of the last six men he's been in with. And one thing I can't get out of my mind, Richie, is the fact that he's the bigger man. He's the natural lightweight. And Rowlands, despite the fact he's never been stopped, has been operating as a super feather. It's going to be fascinating whether he can take Chamberlain's power. Exactly. You know, Chamberlain, he's a big puncher. He's tall, he's rangy. So Ramlab straight away, he's, he's going to be up against it here. In terms of experience, the Latvians box 92 rounds as a professional, which is exactly double the number that Chamberlain's had. And he's showing good intent here to come forward. He's caught by the left hand, and now Chamberlain might think about getting to work. And that's two or three good solid left hands that he's managed to land in that particular exchange. So a bit of success with that left hand in the first round. He's just starting to redden a little bit around the eye already. Crowd are very much behind him tonight. Lots of fans here from the south coast for Chamberlain. They tried to let that left hand go again. Final few seconds here in the first round, and the better shots in this opening three minutes have been landed by Chamberlain. Ramlabs again showing decent ambition here to try and take the fight to Chamberlain. That Chamberlain does. Chamberlain took one there and yeah. the didn't he? Left hand and back. Just snapped his head around. Good action, good left hand from Chamberlain, putting his punches together in centre ring. Good shot, Chamberlain, left hand really solid, but didn't he take it well, Ramlabs? Ramlabs with a good left hand, and that got applause from his corner. Chamberlain's had success, but Ramlabs has taken those power punches well, and he keeps finding ways to have success of his own in there. There's a bit of blood around the ear of Chamberlain. I'm not sure whether that's come from somewhere else or whether there's any kind of damage there, but he's really putting his punches together smartly there. Good shots by Chamberlain, good power punches from Chamberlain. Ramlabs just lets it bounce off him and carries on marching forward. He's a tough kid, isn't he? Mark Chamberlain in the blue, and Archons Ramlabs in the black and purple. Great work from Chamberlain with his back to the ropes. Good work by Chamberlain behind that jab. Good jab again. Yeah. Never more like it. Look at that. Beautiful boxing. Excellent work from Chamberlain. Just one or two signs that Ramlabs might be starting to find the pace a little bit tough in there. Damage to the face of Bram Labs as well. Now that's a good shot by Chamberlain. First time he's taken a backward step. He's hard in there. Chamberlain looking for the finish. Bram Labs all of a sudden and leveling in there towards the end of the sixth round. The most dominant part of the fight so far from Chamberlain. Bram Labs looking to dig deep, but he's not got a great deal left, you think. Chamberlain calls him in, nails him with a left hand. Blood all over the face of Ramlab. There's another big left from Chamberlain, and he's going to be so relieved to hear the bell, the man from Latvia. Ramlab's looking open. There's not a great deal coming back. Chamberlain nails him with a jab, gets him to the ropes, and starts to unload again. Ramlab's is wobbling. Ramlab's might be going. Marcus McDonald has a look. Inside the final 30 seconds of the seventh, Ramlab's tried to land the long left. Chamberlain with the uppercut. Good punch. Yes, that cut has changed things, hasn't it, psychologically, for Ramlabs. It's a good left from Ramlabs, yeah. he bounced it straight off that cut that's oozing blood already. Chamberlain falls back to the ropes again, Ramlabs digging so deep, Chamberlain catches him with the left hand. Oh, good uppercut in there as well, but just had the legs started to stiffen momentarily. That's going to spur on Ramlabs even more, but he might get more out of Chamberlain, who hits him with a really sharp left hand and then through sheer fatigue, I think, loses his balance. Yeah. And again, Ramlabs, better work from him, pushing Chamberlain back to the ropes again. Chamberlain has to keep it long. Ramlabs continues to come forward. He's found something, come somewhere. It's astonishing. I thought he was ready to go, you know. Yeah, he was. 
He was. That cut has changed everything. Good work from Chamberlain. Good combination, forcing Ramlaus back. Minute to go in the ninth. Best work from Chamberlain in this round. I think it was a little left up of the flex that went in, and Ramlaus on the back foot now. Really good work, wasn't it, Richie, from Chamberlain? Just what he needed right at the start of this final round. Something to send the Latvian backwards, something to make the Latvian think twice, and he's trying to build on it now, Chamberlain. And Ramlaus is so tired, wants to hold on, and Chamberlain says, come on, let's go toe-to-toe -to -toe here. Big shots from Chamberlain. He's really going for, he's going for the stoppage here. Fletch, I think Chamberlain, blood pouring from Chamberlain's eye. Oh, takes one, great shot, Chamberlain, the leg stiffen. Ramlaus might be ready, left hand again from Chamberlain. Can he take it out in the tenth round? Brilliant punch from Chamberlain. Ramlaus losing his balance, but was so happy to hold. Chamberlain again can't miss, Ramlaus on the ropes. Marcus McDonnell having a look, down goes Ramlaus, and he stopped it. It's a stoppage victory for Mark Chamberlain. Chamberlain, despite the dreadful cut, has managed to get the stoppage in the most spectacular way in the final round of an absolute cracker here at York Hall. Just when we expected Ramlaps to come out like a steam train, Chamberlain raised his game and caught Ramlaps with the better, cleaner shots in that round flex. That was pretty special indeed. You were expecting Ramlaps to come and, and land big shots, and he walked onto a couple of crackers. Lovely left up a cut that went in there from Mark Chamberlain, and then he knew that he had him. At the time of 1 minute 21 seconds in the 10th and final round, your referee, Marcus McDonald, pulls a halt to this contest. Therefore, your winner by TKO... And... Still.